So the company Telson has kindly sent me out this charging case for the DJ Action 3 and 4. So let's take it out of the box and have a look. So let's take a closer look at the Telson charger case. So on the side here, we've got the charging port, that's the USB-C. And on the bottom, just the input and output voltages. So let's take a look inside. You just flip the lid open. And just on the inside there, you've got room for two micro SD cards. And inside there, it's going to hold three batteries. I've got a couple of Action 4 batteries to pop inside here, just to show you the voltage. So it's going to pop in and push down and you're going to get the reading on the front. Now as you can see there's four LEDs where each battery goes and each LED equates to 25%. So you can clearly see this one's at 75% and this one's at 50%. But when you start charging the batteries inside of this unit it's going to find the battery with the most charging first and then fully charge that up and then work in sequence. Unfortunately, it's not going to charge them all at once. It's just going to charge one at a time. So it's going to take around 75 minutes to fully charge one of these DJI Action 4 batteries from 0% to 100%. So just over three and a half hours to fully charge all three batteries from 0% to 100%. So when the batteries are slotted inside of the case, the only way to check the voltage is to open the lid. That automatically highlights the LEDs on the front to show you the charge. So there'll be three ways to charge this unit. So you've got your USB-C at the side. You'll be able to charge that in your car via a power bank or from the mains adapter at home. So I also have the DJI charging case. I want to compare that with a Telsin charging case. Obviously straight away the Telsin's larger, the DJI one's smaller, but the DJI one weighs more than the Telsin. Just a slight just slightly heavier the DJI one. Now they both charge three batteries, but both not at the same time. Where the Telsin one beats the DJI one is you've got more of an accurate visual on the charge. For instance, we've got 75% in this one. Now this one, as you can see, you've no idea really. It would have been best on the DJI charger if they'd integrated four LEDs there. Because straight away, each one's 25% on the Telsin, so you've got a good idea. But on the DJI one, you just get a red, amber and green light. Both well made and designed well, but the Telsin one just wins there, as you can see exactly what the charge is in the battery. So if you're thinking of buying this Telsin charging case for the DJI Action 3 or 4, I'll be leaving a link in the description and there you'll receive 10% off when you enter the coupon code. So as always, thanks for watching, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Bye for now.